George Zimmerman, who is, of course, the former neighborhood watchman who was acquitted in the shooting and killing of unarmed teenager Trayvon Martin, didn't draw too many fans at an Orlando gun show where he was signing pictures of himself. Zimmerman's appearance was advertised. This is a real story. OK, this isn't from The Onion. It was advertised on the New Orlando gun shows Facebook page with come and meet George Z. He's here a few more hours. And no matter what you read, there are no protesters, lunatics or other varieties of clowns. Over the course of six hours, fewer than 20 people at the gun show asked for a free autograph photo of George Zimmerman, who was situated in a rear office of the arms room gun store in Orlando. The gun show was originally booked at Orlando's Majestic Events Center. It was canceled after they found out George Zimmerman was going to be signing up, uh, signing pictures there, but they were able to get another venue. One couple showed up to meet George Zimmerman. They were identified as Melissa and Matt, and they were the only people waiting in line to meet George Zimmerman. I would love to know more about Melissa and Matt's lives, that they stand in line to meet George Zimmerman. Melissa said he seemed nervous and actually a little bit scared to be there. He also appeared emotional, like he was really thankful and touched that people would come out to see him um, and that uh, they were also shocked about how much weight he had gained. George Zimmerman said, everything's good. We're having fun. I'm just here to meet supporters. He was also joined by his on again, off again girlfriend, Samantha Scheib, who last year accused him of forcing her out of the house and pointing a gun at her. No better place to show her support for her boyfriend than at a gun show. On the scale of how nuts you are around George Zimmerman, uh, there's kind of one side, which is, well, you think he was clearly guilty of murder and shouldn't have had any weapons with him uh, and shouldn't be able to have weapons now after his uh, um, uh, uh, killing of Trayvon Martin. And on the other side would be kind of in the middle would be, well, he's a troubled guy. And by the letter of the law, he wasn't guilty, but the law should be changed. And I, I wouldn't really want to be around George Zimmerman on the far end of the lunacy spectrum is you would go to a gun show to meet George Zimmerman, who's famous for killing a kid and have him sign a picture for you. What other killer? Notice I'm not using the term murderer, which has a legal implication. What other killer does anyone recall showing up at gun shows like he were famous for something good and signing autographed pictures? Do you remember anyone, Lewis? This is sickening. I don't, David, but uh, I'm willing to bet that if Oswald were, were at uh, at signings, uh, there'd probably be a line out the door. Yeah, well, I mean, retrospectively, now that might be the case. At the time, I think it would have been a far different situation. George Zimmerman's 15 minutes have to be up pretty soon, right? Isn't he due back in the backseat of a police car or like Joe the plumber taking a job that is in direct contradiction to his stated principles like Joe Plummer taking a union job. I think it's going to be up soon for George Z. Subscribe to our channel. New videos every day. Forget about boring corporate media. Click below to subscribe.